uh, yesterday that is on 21 9 2020 jntu has released a circular uh, stating that second and third spell of university examinations so everybody got surprised with this circular because uh, uh, everyone knows that finally the exams uh, schedule already given and the exams are happened as per the schedule now what is this second and third spell exams so let us see uh, what jnt states so it is released by the dr v kamakshi prasad director of evaluation jnt h on yesterday that is on 21 9 2020 uh, which is directed to all the principals of the jnt and affiliated college so this is regarding the second and third spell university exams and uh, so what it states is the principals are informed to note that the second spell of university exams are likely to be commenced from second week of october 2020 this notification will be issued shortly so they have it not yet a released uh, notification it, this will come in short time the second spell ex semester examination comprises of the regular and supply examinations of all pg courses including form d and uh, all 1 1 2 1 3 1 4 1 supply exams of p tech and b form courses so whatever the pg courses are there regular and supply examinations of all pg courses and also the supplementary exams of first semester of b tech and b pharmacy will be included in this second spell of examinations whereas all the regular examinations that is uh, 1 2 2 2 and 3 2 exams uh, of b tech and b pharmacy courses will be conducted in third spell of the examinations so this with this will uh, commence from the last week of october 2020 okay so that means total three phase of exams wherein the first phase of exam is about uh, four to regular examinations that is over in the second spell all the regular and supply examinations of pg courses and the first semester supplementary exams of btech and bpharmc courses whereas in the third spell all the regular examinations of BTEC that is even semester, first year, second semester, second year, second semester and third year, second semester exams will be conducted. And these exams will uh, commence in last week of the October 2020 as per the circular. So in order to conduct the examination, the student is given uh, to opt the three center preferences which are nearest to them. And uh, if no center you have opted, then uh, by default, whatever the college you are wherever you are studying your btech then that will become your uh, center by default okay so that's what it is stated the students those who wish to write their examinations at the parent college should not give the preferences okay if you are given preferences means you are writing the exam in some other colleges where if you are not given any preferences means you are uh, preferring to write the college in your own college wherever you are studying the btech that is the about this one <coughs> Then similarly, they have stated about the MBA students also. Then, <coughs> the once after the center preferences is over, the university will finalize the allot the centers and uh, finalize this. After that, if anyone wants to change the center, then there will be a penalty of thousand rupees. That is also officially given. Okay. Then the services for semester examination registrations of all examinations. Uh, uh, and all semesters of with late fee are now enabled so the principals are informed to communications communicate with all the students those who have not yet registered for their semester examinations okay the registration also they are once again they are opening so this will also commence like in the first spell in next two spells also the colleges are requested to extend their services and uh, they have given some instructions to autonomous colleges and also some affiliated colleges regarding the conduction of examination and packing this but the main uh, main uh, content of this letter is that the university confirmed that they will be conducting the exams uh, for all the years previously everybody thought were only uh, the exams will be conducted for the final years as the university successfully completed the exams for final years for two then they are planning to conduct uh, the remaining exams that is the regular exams as well as the supplementary exams for btech and uh, pg courses so in the second spell as the pg strength is low they will be their plan to conduct the pg courses all regular and supply and along with the pg courses they want to also conduct the supplementary exams of btech first semester that is for first year first semester second year first semester third year first semester and four one supplementary exams and uh, in the last phase they will be taking up the regular examinations of the event semester that is the 1 2 2 2 and 3 2 so uh, this is an unexpected uh, for all the students so everybody in a mood that the exams will not be conducted for uh, first second third years only the exams will be conducted for the final years but whereas 
the circular confirmed that the exams will be conducted and this entire process will be uh, ended in the month of october end of uh, october only so my dear students so get ready and start your preparation and uh, we wish you all the best everybody knows that everybody expected that exams will not be conducted and they will be directly promoted so but this with the circular once again the university made clear statement that they will be conducting the exams uh, so you have to prepare for the exams uh, that's all from our side if you have anything please uh, you can put your comments in uh, uh, comment box thank you